Sequence A. What is sequence A all about? I'd say it's about showing the character's strength and weakness. We're talking about the hero. And for most of the examples here, we'll have a single protagonist. I will show a few examples where we have more than one. And that complicates matters. And if you're a beginning screenwriter, I wouldn't recommend to go there until you master the single protagonist journey. You prepare your call to adventure. And I think this is a really important one. It's also underestimated. You are using that first sequence to set up everything you need to make that call to adventure as impactful as possible. Ultimately, everything in your script needs to serve a purpose. And to me, the, the main purpose of sequence A is to really make it clear to the audience that what's going to happen at the end of that sequence is going to be really uh, important. It's going to be a really big deal to our hero. In sequence A, we also introduce what we call the ordinary world. That's the normal world of our character before they go into this journey of change. And if the writing works, if the film works usually at the end, the world may have changed a bit, at least from the perspective, from the POV of our main character. I'm going to talk about the energy in these stages because I think that is really important. The energy of a, a sequence has an impact on how the audience experiences it. And film is all about emotion. The emotion the audience goes through as they watch the film. I say film, I don't say TV. Now, much of what I say does also apply to television, but it's much more difficult to apply the eight sequence structure to television because the sequences are 10 to 15 minutes. In television, that equates to an act. So when you have a one hour TV program, Usually you have four acts and those are rarely subdivided further. So you'd say we have um, eight sequences in feature film and four acts in a one hour TV drama. So energy is something I'll be talking about a lot in that first sequence. The energy is one of fragile equilibrium. The hero is getting by. They're not happy. There's something in the, their lives that needs to be changed, that they need to address. And uh, the end of sequence A in my books is always the call to adventure. There's always a major event that happens to our character that pushes them onto their journey, that pushes them to act.